question. Um, well, I mean, it's like a double-edged sword with the social media, I guess, is like, uh, there's a lot of exposure and a lot of ways to reach out to people globally. And I think that's probably the coolest thing about the internet and social media and stuff like that is, is the fact that, um, you know, he can take, a, my friend Rob can take a picture, post it, and somebody in uh, wherever can see it, you know, Indonesia, Africa, something, you know, so, um, the access to our culture, which is very underground, yeah. that's cool. In the last, I don't know, whatever many years now. Yeah. Um, you know, the downside is always, there's always a downside, you know, just going on there and making up stories and being goofy and, you know, all this, all this other kind of stuff. But, yeah, I mean, I think the coolest thing is basically related to that that our culture is, some, is starting to move around the world and be known and be respected in other areas of the world. And, uh, I mean, Europe, it's been a thing for a long time now. Very long time. I mean, I've been coming to Europe since I was 16, 17 years old. So, um, it's kind of established here. But uh, things like this are happening, you know, like, been doing more of these things, which is cool because tattoos in our world go hand in hand. Yeah. And so we, we did a, a big Paris convention, and now we've been asked to do this convention. For whatever reason, in the last bunch of years, we've been doing things like this, which I think makes sense because it brings these kind of things together, these cultures together. Um, it's been a lot of exciting things in the last bunch of years. No. The festivals have been happening for years now, but uh, which kind of opened up a door. Yes, I do actually. Um, I, I, I think I waited long enough by like 10 years or something. So, um, <laughs> yeah. I've been busy. You know, yeah. we've been busy with Madball. I've been busy having a family, life. So, uh, a lot of things sort of happened between that last release and now. But I recently got together with my, with my boy Stress, my DJ, who's also produced a lot of my stuff. and. Um, yeah, he's been sending me a lot of new material and I've been writing. There's stuff that I wrote like five, six years ago that I just never released. So maybe I'm just gonna put everything together and put it out. Oh, cool. You're asking a lot of good questions. <laughs> Thank you. Um, they're different, which is cool. Um, you try to, but it's very hard. Yeah. It's very hard to project what happens in a live scenario because that is just a feeling thing. You know, that's just like the show starts and it's just like a different uh, thing. And it's hard to bring that into a studio setting. Yeah. But 
in the last bunch of years, I do try to imagine what a song would be like live. And I didn't, in the very beginning, our first albums, I didn't think of it in that way. We just sort of did the songs and like, you know, said whatever we had to say, pissed off, whatever, you know. And it's still the same idea, but there are certain moments where I, I try to picture how it would be live now. That's more in recent records, you know, like later years. And I think that there's, I think that that's not a bad thing because live is the ultimate experience, you know, with every style of music, you know, that's the ultimate yeah. representation, you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, if we currently the, the 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 lineup we have now feels really good. You know, uh, we went through some changes, and it, it feels really, really natural and comfortable right now um, with all the guys. And the newest members are guitarists, and he's never recorded with us, so that's actually exciting moving forward because there'll be a new person in the mix with us writing and recording it. We'll see. We'll see what his vibe is and what he brings to the table. But, um, I mean, the personalities and everything involved right now, I mean, top. Everyone really cool and everyone really into what they do and what part they play in the band. Very respectful vibe, very cool vibe. Uh, couldn't ask for a better situation than as far as math all goes right now. Yeah. Really, really good situation. Always good. Yeah. We love coming here. I mean, you know, we, we haven't been, we were trying to figure out, um, it's been like a couple of years or? It's been a couple of years, yeah. maybe, yeah. But it's always good to play Portugal and then we're going to Spain after this. Spain's always cool. I mean, there's always a, a warmth with the people and everything. So yeah, it's always good. Okay. Get to shoot a video with my voice from Devil and Me. I did that earlier. Yeah. So uh, it's always good time. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.